A new season, the 102nd in Aggie basketball history. The curtain comes up on Friday night at Reed Arena. For every college basketball team hoping to march to the dance, the first steps are taken in an exhibition contest. The Aggies welcome to Texas Permian Basin for their rehearsal. And for Hoops fans here at A&M, uh, two of the more anticipated debuts here tonight, Smith and Space. Nice rebound by Sean Smith all the way up the floor to Jordan Green. Layup, got it, and he's fouled. Do you feel like he kind of had to knock some rust off, or did, it, or did the game kind of flow kind of come to you uh, sooner than expected? I feel like I had to knock some rust off. You know, I haven't played in a few years, you know, since I redshirted and everything, but I feel like I went out there and played hard, which was the main thing I was focusing on, playing hard and encouraging my teammates. And um, just listening to what older guys telling me, like, go harder, don't worry about, you know, the little things, just keep it up and keep playing. So I pretty much just went out there and just had fun and enjoyed playing with my teammates. 14-14 to go in the contest. Trying to find some space is Antoine Space. Missed jumper off the glass. Nice rebound, Devontae Fitzgerald. His putback is good and he's fouled. Harris trying to get free with the dribble. Into the paint. Nice pass to Tavario Miller and the dunk. Tavario Miller slams it home, 10-point A&M lead. Pretty good defense there by the Falcons. Now Jones trying to get free. He does get into the lane, and he got a layup. Nice job, Jamal Jones. 14-13, that'd be about the last lead Permian Basin had. Here's a steal <laughs> and a dunk by Devontae Fitzgerald. Thundered it home, and the Aggie lead is back out to 16 points. Fabian Harris back in the ball game now. Just went to the basket and got a layup right through the defense. Play good defense. Uh, made a few layups, a couple of passes. I was out there vocal, talking to my teammates, encouraging them, all of them tonight, especially Sean. This is his uh, first, you know, action out there because he redshirted last year, and I was just trying to encourage Sean every time he got the ball to drive him and Jamal. Coach told us we get steals, pushing in transition. We're not going to be walking the ball up um, this year that much. We're going to push it on um, breaks, and if we got to run offense in half court, that's what we're going to do. Fabian Harris enters his senior season. A long, hard road brought him to College Station. Growing up many days in fear on Chicago's east side created a rigidness only few could understand. Even fewer have experienced the family losses Fabian has suffered. Chicago took his mother, brother, cousin, and best friend, but not his heart. Violence was the norm, like every day you hear like gunshots, you hear somebody getting shot, somebody getting beat up. When it started happening, when I lost my mom in 96, I kind of lost, I was young, but I kind of lost my uh, my head. Like I was doing all type of bad stuff. But then as I got a little older, my big brother was there, named Xavier Shipman. He was kind of like a dad to me, so he kind of told me like, you need to stop getting in trouble and you need to focus on school, play football, because that was my first sport. I need you to go to football practice because that'll keep you off the streets. So I started doing that more. Then I started playing basketball. He said, yo, you got a gift with this, so I need you to stay focused on that and let me handle everything else. But out of high school, I signed with the University of Houston. I went down there. Like, I'm thinking this is going to be it for me. So my test scores didn't go through, and just, like, the environment down there was not for me. And after that, I just bounced around to other schools. And when I got to CSI, I just felt like that was home for me. I got the Twin Falls, you know, been through all that. So I'm still got that chip on my shoulder. I'm angry at the world. Start hanging out with my teammates, hanging out with the coaches more, getting involved in the community. And I just fell in love with it. It, it kind of matured me. Then when I came here, it just felt like an upgrade from where I came from. Everybody welcome you with open arms. The environment around here is good. It's a, a family environment. Here's uh, Fabian shooting a three. Got it! That's a three, 70 to 68, 10 seconds to go. Big shots, I've been taking them all my life with all the losses I took, so me coming on the court taking a big shot, ain't no pressure at all. With us, it's beyond basketball. It's more than basketball, because we do consider ourselves a family. We go out and do what families do. We go out to eat as a team. We go out to the movies as a team. We hang out at each other um, apartments, play the game as a team. Like. Like Coach said, this team is a family, and it's the closest team I've been on. No lie, this is the closest team I've been on so far. 
together months of preparation lead up to the November 9th tip-off against Buffalo. A trip to Alabama for SEC media days and photo shoots mean opening day is looming. Yeah, I'm ready to go. Look at this. Right. <laughs> Billy Donovan's been able to do what the program Ohio State, you know, over the years. When we run in condition, everybody condition. And it just, it shows a lot of heart in everybody being able, ready to play for this year. The basketball squad is not the only ones getting ready for the season. Signs begin to appear on campus as well as practice for the Aggie dance team. All right, music start. The squad will usher in new traditions at Reed Arena. Of stability. Do like a, a spread apart, but straight. In the film room, Coach Kennedy gets his team ready for one last preseason practice. They at the top, they get through. Guard Tony Parker, all those guys, they, took, they get through screens. They do not, they're little, okay? So we should get through screens. Let's go, man. We got three days before the game. Let's go, man. Activate. Let's First set, running basic. All right. On the break, run all your quick stuff. Alright, so out of bounds, one out. One out to Boston right here. Hey, win on three. One, two, three. Win. Get it, get it, Sean. Get it, Sean. Got it, Sean. Two hands. Yeah. Score. Hey, wait, wait. Rebound. Come on, Corny. Go, 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 go. Run. Get there. Turn. Turn. Get the help. Get the help, Jordan. Get the help, Jordan. Get the help. Good, good, good. 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 Alright. Same spot. On that blue, you gotta get behind the screen. You may have to come all the way out here, Devontae. Right here, all right? So no deflection. Let's go, last time. Last time, turn and run. This team we're playing, juniors and seniors, they're gonna push the ball up the floor. You, you backpedal, you're gonna get beat. Turn and run, we don't backpedal. Good, good, lower, lower, Jamal, lower, lower. Talk, 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 I got help, I got help. I, who's got the basket, who's got the basket? Good, good. Play it, play it, play it, play it. The Aggies are ready for the new season. Under the guidance of third-year headman Billy Kennedy, they still have much to prove in the SEC. Cold tub, guys. Cold tub. Come on, we're lifting together.